coworker of ours, Chad Martin, who uh, was a support member of the team last year. And he just brought it up during lunch one day with Ben and I and uh, described the event and you know, talked about how Eric Weinmeier had started it. And uh, I think before he was finished with his story, I said, I'm in. Uh, because it's, uh, it sounded incredible. And pretty much everything Eric touches, uh, you know is going to be special. So um, that's, that's how it started. Day one, we're, we're hiking slash riding slash carrying on the, what was uh, named the whip of the scorpion tail. Uh, the toughest, toughest part of the, the, of the two days. To Topher's uh, riding his bike and uh, Jared's behind him pushing and I'm in front towing. And uh, we're, <laughs> we're spending about 15 or 20 minutes identifying wild wildflowers. And um, as we passed another team, uh, talking about columbines and daisies and, and different types of sage, uh, the look on the, the, the other team, the uh, look on their faces was, was pretty amazing as they were struggling uphill. Uh, I don't know if we were just in a different mindset or, uh, or what. really enjoyed it all. I really enjoyed watching all my teammates succeed at everything. I really enjoyed watching Jake make it to the top of the climb. I really enjoyed the whitewater rafting, just zipping over the water. I was a little scared about that with the high CFS. It's been higher, it's higher than it's ever been, ever, I guess. I enjoyed meeting all my friends that were also racing on different teams. I really enjoyed careening down the zip line towards this water going Mach 10 um, and then spinning around backwards and really hoping that the rubber band system would slow me down before I slammed into the poison ivy on the tree. I enjoyed, but oh, there's so much to enjoy. I just enjoyed the enjoyment. Being up on that rock face, I was presented with physical fatigue and my fear of heights. And it was really, really stressful. And I did make it to the top, and that was the goal. Luckily, I had the support of my teammates. My teammates actually asked me what I needed. And my teammates were able to assist me and were able to guide me down. some of the most amazing parts of our journey were where the entire team, you know, five people, six people on one day, were all involved in the same exact task. Um, being, being creative and working through situations that uh, require five or six brains to, to get through. Um, not just, you know, mentally, but physically as well. And, I think that's that's just a it's a real eye opener. The knowledge that I can do this, that I can do something this physically taxing on my body and come away with it knowing that I completed all of the activities that we had to do um, and that I know that I can do it again. 